Hey Fit Fam, welcome back to Neri's Kitchen, your go-to spot for delicious and healthy recipes. Today, we have something special for all of you belly burners out there, a sneak peek into week three of our 28-day belly burn program. Coach RJ sent me the plan and we're about to build it out together. So grab your pens and notebooks because we're diving into the nitty gritty of calories and macros. All right, let's share my screen and get started on building out this week's meals plan on my fitness pal. So here's the plan for the week. We're making some adjustments, cutting back on calories, but ensuring you stay satisfied. Remember, it's about finding that sweet spot where you're not starving, but still in a calorie deficit. All right, so here is week three of our meal plan. Let's get started. Let's open our my fitness pal and make some adjustments. So if I go back under goals, we are cutting calories this week, so RJ sent me 1,200 calories. Let's change that. And he wants our protein to be 50%, carbs and fats, so that looks good already. And then let's go into our diary here. And RJ wants us to have our green shake, so that's the first thing I'm going to have for breakfast. So let's input that in here. And of course, we're keeping a greens power shake as our first meal. It's a powerhouse of nutrients. A green supplement, which is ice, a handful of spinach and water all blended together. You can spice it up with turmeric and ginger for that extra detox kick, but it is optional. And then I like to have some high protein for breakfast to feel fuller. So again, let's add my egg whites. Okay. Now let's build out our lunch and I always start with my protein. So let's have some skinless rotisserie chicken. This week, we're tweaking our fasting routine. Say goodbye to the daily 16 hour fast. We're switching to alternating big and low fasting days. If you ever feel too hungry or dizzy, listen to your body. Have a meal, but make your protein your first calorie. Ounce portions. I like to have about six ounces. Okay, and then let's see, let's add some veggies with that as well. I like to have my tomatoes with my chicken. And then I like to eat cucumbers because cucumbers and tomatoes go hand in hand together. So I like to have about, um, about 100 grams raw cucumbers. And then let's build out our lunch. Oh, let's change that here. 100. Okay, now I have about 600 calories to work with. So for lunch, I'm not a big, or for dinner, I'm not a big dinner eater. I like to have some small things. I think I might keep it simple and just have like a tuna salad, let's say. Add tuna, have one can there. Okay, I have about 500 calories. Let's make, let's see how far we are into our protein goals. Almost met it, we're short about 30, 40-ish. So let's supplement that with um, protein shake. Pay attention to Wednesdays, folks. It's our refeed day. After two days of lower calories, we're refilling those muscles with a boost of calories and carbs. Perfect for those Fit Club lifts. And notice the change in macros. We're carb cycling to tap into stored body fat as fuel. I'm gonna stick with my kale salad. I always have that on hand. So here's the dressing. And then I want my kale salad, the salad only part. There we go, okay. So always make sure you look at your macronutrients to know where you're at. So if you look at my fiber again, it's quite low. So let's add some fiber gummies in here. I like to have that for breakfast. So I'm going to add some fiber gummies. Oh, there we go. Okay, so I have 200 calories left. And I think that looks good for now. So I'm just going to leave this as is. Just, and I can start adding or just, uh, you know, changing it as the day goes on, but this is something that I would typically have on my lower calorie days. Thanks guys. And quick reminders, Fit Fam, if those low calorie days feel too tough, or if you ever feel stuffed, communicate with RJ. This program is about finding what works for you. And if the refeed doesn't feel sufficient on your high calorie days, 
let RJ know for adjustments. Remember, it's not just about numbers, it's about feeling good and making sustainable choices. Stay tuned for the delicious recipes we'll be whipping up this week to fit perfectly into your personalized meal plan. Until next time, keep burning that belly and stay healthy.